we are there just to present or represent the Motobot concept. And the Motobot is really an advanced technology because it's working on the autonomous vehicle and it seems impossible to consider autonomous vehicle on a two-wheeler, but we did it and we are developing it. And also it's a, a direction, a very exciting direction for the engineers. But Yamaha has a robotics division as well as a, a motorcycle division. Uh, part of the idea of starting this project was to combine the, the history and the excellence of both divisions, put it together in a new project and try something bold and ambitious. We picked a very difficult target to get a humanoid to ride a motorcycle. Most vehicle manufacturers are heavily modifying the vehicles to create autonomous systems. And we decided that retrofittable autonomy may be interesting. Yamaha makes a diverse variety of vehicles. We think that a humanoid form that can control any of these vehicles is an interesting target. In order to help the development, we set two very ambitious targets. First, we wanted to cross 200 kilometers per hour on a racetrack. And the second was to beat Valentino Rossi's lap time on a racetrack. We worked hard on both goals over several years. We got well past 200 miles, kilometers an hour, sorry. We got past 200 kilometers an hour, but uh, we came a little bit short of Valentino Rossi's lap time. Yeah, honestly, it's really incredible. We're here with a new addition to the Yamaha family, the, the Motorbot. It's uh, the technology to, to be able to have a robot Riding the bike like I do is, is honestly is, is, is really incredible. It's uh, he doesn't say that much, so I don't know what he thinks about the bike. But the uh, yeah, to see some of the, the images, some of the videos that, that having the bike riding on track, yeah, it's, it's something that five ten years ago would have thought was impossible. So yeah, the, the motorboat is the future. Uh, it's right behind me. Uh, I've seen it's getting faster and faster. It's really interesting, but I hope it's not getting too fast because then I will be without a job. We're still deciding on what the future of Motobot is. We hope it'll live on for a very long time. Mm -hmm.